Hello guys, my name is Lee Jones from Jonah 101 Football Training. And then I'm Brandon Jones from CrossFit Training and Strength and Conditioning. As you can see above, you can see all the details about us. Uh, what we're going to do is try and just tell you about the programme, uh, any concerns that you've got or frequently asked questions. I'm going to ask Brandon a lot of questions about the strength and conditioning side. He's going to ask me about the football side and hopefully that will clear up any questions that you've got for us uh, before purchasing the programme. Uh, you ready, Brandon? Fire. How many sessions a week uh, is the strength and conditioning then? Right, um, what I've set up for you guys, you're going to do three sessions a week, so um, make sure you put some time aside during the off-season or during this program. Um, it is 45 minutes to an hour, three times a week. Spread it out, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or Monday, Thursday, Saturday, depending on how your schedule goes. Obviously, try and tie it in with the, um, the skills program that Lee will provide you. Fantastic. Um, and what equipment do you need uh, to, to run this program? All right, I'll try to keep it really simple. Um, things like a pull-up bar, a kettlebell, boxes to jump on. Um, we've tried to limit it so that um, everybody can participate. If you've got access to a gym, you're going to be in perfect hands. Um, if you don't, just obviously use a bit of um, a tech, uh, initiative, try and find a crossbar or a branch on a tree or whatever the case is. A lot of the stuff's body weight, but where you need equipment to see if you can um, improvise. Definitely. That's what I want to try and do. If you remember, Jim, you, you're good to go. Um, who is the program designed for? Uh, anyone who's quite serious about progressing in their football, um, anything from ages 13 up and onwards, um, can do this program. Um, obviously, modify within within reason or within your own abilities. But anybody sort of from teenager plus can do this program. It, it's scalable. Um, yeah, have a crack. I also recommend that it's a, be a good idea to do this with um, with a friend or a training partner. Um, it's just way more fun than, than um, putting yourself through the, the pain of exercise on your own. All right, cool. I think that, that leads me on to my next question. What if you haven't got a training partner? Well, good. Just self-discipline. Stick out at the program there for you. Um, there will be a support group. If you've got any questions or anything like that, you can direct it to Lee or myself. Um, but yeah, have a crack. Uh, three sessions a week across the eight week program. Eight week program. <laughs> um, yeah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine on your own. Just more fun with the body. There is. Best friends. <laughs> there is. The, but we, I'll jump into it now. You'll definitely need to definitely find a training partner for the soccer sessions, but for the gym sessions, you can do it on your own. Um, all right, Brandon, move on to my next question. What can you expect in, 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 in just like a normal session there? All right, um, what I've tried to focus on for, for you guys, specifically sort of football players, um, is things like um, explosive power, speed, uh, muscular endurance, cardiovascular endurance. So basically, we just want to get you fit as well as strengthen the muscles. We find that during the season, a lot of football players neglect their actual strength side of things and they focus just purely on uh, cardio and respiratory endurance so their, um, their mobility uh, depreciates, their, um, their flexibility depreciates, things like that. So we really want to make sure that you, um, you work on the things that get neglected during the season so that you can be better come next season. Fantastic, so that leads to my next question. Uh, this program, can it be done during season and in the off season as well? Absolutely, absolutely. The, the more you do it, the body obviously adapts, um, you recover a lot quicker. Um, I would always encourage people to do strength and conditioning training throughout the year. Obviously you go through different phases, um, deload phases, things like that, where you focus more on the strength and more on the conditioning. Uh, but there's no reason why you couldn't do this um, every single day of the year. Fantastic. Uh, you've already told me how long the sessions are, 45 minutes to an hour. Um, you've already told me what the main aim is up to get out of the sessions. Um, and the last question then, before you ask me some questions, is why, why is strength and conditioning important for footballers? Um, it's a very neglected um, part of the game. Um, you can turn around and look at some of the celebrities out there. Um, uh, you can, ones that have come to me, Christian Ronaldo, he takes his shirt off, the guy is, is on another level when it comes to, um, to fitness, to conditioning. Um, there's other players that definitely uh, definitely need to work on things like that, even at the top level. Um, it's actually quite embarrassing to see how many players out there have got no conditioning. Um, they've got amazing footwork and amazing skills, 
but they've got no lungs, no, no strength, no endurance. So it's definitely a missing factor in, um, in the football industry. And that, for me, is what I believe separates the good players from the average. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right, cool, Leo. Can you see my turn? Oh. <laughs> Which side? This side? No. Right. All right, Lee. Um, what equipment do the guys need? Um, this is quite a tricky one because obviously football sessions are completely different to the gym or strength and conditioning. Uh, the whole program can be done with a couple of cones and a ball, but for some specific sessions it would be ideal if you've got more than one ball, so i.e. a bag of footballs. What me and Brandon don't want is you guys going out there and spending a lot of money. However, it's going to make the program better for you if you have access to a little bit of equipment. You'll see in the videos that some of it's got loads of equipment in there, but you can actually be done without all the equipment. But uh, you definitely need a football, you definitely need a training partner, um, and you will need access to a field, 100%, and a goal as well. You will need a football goal, but all the added extras are within the program, so all, all the uh, equipment needs are, are within the program. Cool. How long are the skill sessions? Uh, they will definitely go for one hour, if not longer. Uh, again, all the details are within the program. Um, with my sessions, I want everyone to keep going until they pretty much get the skills right. Uh, some people might pick, pick it up quicker than others, but they will all last roughly an hour, similar to the strength and conditioning. Um, can you do the skills sessions on your own, or do you need a partner? Um, I think... Uh, 60 to 70 percent you can do on your own, um, but again, myself and Brandon, we massively encourage getting a training partner with similar level to you, um, which is going to not only motivate each other to get better, but um, some of the drills do require a training partner. Yeah, um, but yeah, you'll see in the program that some sessions you may not be able to do on your own because obviously the football side is a bit more specific. So, for the skill sessions, do the guys need access to a field? Yes, they do. Um, only with some, though. I reckon, again, there's a lot of the sessions where you can probably do it in your back garden. Um, but the more specific ones, the more advanced ones, you will need access to a bigger area or at least a goal. Because some of the, the sessions requires striking or shooting on goal. So you'll need access to the goal. All right. And who is this, per who is this skills program designed for? Um, the soccer one, pretty much anyone can do. But me and Brandon are trying to aim it more towards 13 plus. The more, it doesn't really matter whether you're a beginner or an elite player, it's going to be super beneficial for anyone really. Um, but we're aiming it more towards players that are super keen to take their game to, to, to the next level. So I guess, what's the, um, what's the main aim of the program? What do you want the guys to get out of it? Um, for the whole program, we're aiming to get you know that skilled athlete. Again, we look at someone like Cristiano Ronaldo or Gareth Bale, players that are not only really skilled on the field but an absolute powerhouse as well on the field. So, in my sessions, I'm looking to make you technically a better footballer. So we're looking at thousands of touches of the ball, which are going to make you com comfortable on the ball, confident, make you a better player. And obviously, Brandon's going to try and turn you into that that athlete that you need to be. Happy days. Anything else? Mm. Uh, the last thing I'm gonna say is, it's really easy to download, guys. Underneath this video, you'll see all the programs there. At the minute, we're gonna show you the easiest way to download. There's a button there that says buy now. Okay, that's gonna take you straight to PayPal. Follow the steps, it's really easy. You should be sent a download link. Click the link, download it, and then you've got access to it on file. Okay, uh, you can then get it on your iPad, your phone, because obviously you're going to want to take an iPad or a phone or maybe a laptop to the field. Yep. Set it up, and hopefully, with the way we've edited it, it's really easy step-by-step -step ways of doing the uh, the workouts or the sessions. Yep. It's really easy, guys. But we are going to be doing a closed Facebook group. So when you actually go to download it, you will get access to a closed Facebook group where me and Brandon will be the admin and we want people to share their um, experiences from the program and uh, all updates will go on there, etc. So and feedback like that. So uh, we're really looking forward to seeing if, yeah, if you guys enjoy it. Video yourself training, whether it's the conditioning stuff or the skill stuff, 
Um, and put it on there, let us know who you are, where in the world you're training. Um, it'd be nice to meet some awesome people out there. And if you're watching this video and you've got this far, make sure you follow CrossFit Strenu on Instagram and Facebook. And uh, Jonah one on Football Training on Facebook and Instagram. If, you're, if you feel like you want to post it on your own Instagram, make sure you tag our accounts or hashtag CrossFit Strenu or hashtag Jonah one on Football Training so we can see how well you guys are doing. We're looking forward to smashing this. Get, get on the weights. <laughs> <laughs>